a little hospitality center overview. We run a 24-7, 365 hybrid model. Our focus is majorly on providing same-day travel for our guests to their sponsor families. About 20 to 30% remain here in the shelter for one to two days in a traditional congregate model. We have a combination of volunteers and permanent staff. Our staff have three eight-hour shifts per day. Our volunteers generally have one to three hour shifts. We have 200 new guests arriving daily. The average stay is less than one night. The max is two nights. We have the capacity to serve 200 guests under this hybrid model. We are receiving 200 people daily and are hoping to increase this number in the next couple of months. A little hospitality process. When guests are first dropped off by ICE, we perform intake, which is data entry, toiletry distribution, wellness checks. We also do that first contact with their sponsors. We let them know that, they're, that their family member is here with us and that they are no longer detained and that they need to buy their tickets so that they can get home to them. During their stay, guests receive three meals a day and have access to snacks. We'll also make their travel arrangements. We purchase their tickets if need be with their money, explain how to navigate the U.S. transportation system, and then finally, when our guests are ready to leave, we provide our guests with transports to the airport or to the bus station, as well as food for their trip. We have partners in the El Paso airport that provide the extra help in navigating the airport system of the United States. They explain to our guests how to navigate TSA, as well as explaining boarding passes and where they can stay while they await to board their plane.